hello guys welcome to my channel how to fix windows update standalone installer then that the update is not applicable to your computer then this is the basic error step is to follow the steps go to the first step bar you will click to the search bar Set the services You will click to open Then scroll down far you see the Windows installer you will see then you will click to right click then properties then you will click to stop to get start okay you will click to okay then you will Windows insider services same type you will right click to properties then manual to change the automatic and stop to starting then you will click to apply click to ok then scroll down for the windows update same time you will right click to properties then automatically this is the already is finished for the automatic then you will click to the services that were already is running you will click to apply click to ok then change then ok then this step is finished to go to the next step for you will click to the search bar search the settings you will click to enter you will click to the update and security then you will click to download ok but not download the you will click to the next step for the troubleshoot you will click to the additional troubleshoot this is the down not download to this problem to solve to not solve to then you will click to the windows update get run as administrator any problem to will get solved ok then this step is finished you will click to close then go to the next step for you will click to search bar search the edit group policy then you will click to open then you will click to the administrative templates you will click to select then click to the windows commands double click to open then scroll down for windows update then click to you will see the automatic updates you will right click to edit then see then for the not configured to change the enable then you will click to apply click to ok then see the enables you will click to close this step is finished to you will click to the windows icon get restart your pc or laptop then this problem is solved after you will get update the windows ok thank you for watching